Hello everybody, welcome to J Cobra Gaming. I'm Jarrett, or J Cobra, as you guys may know. And uh, today is a new Let's Play series. Now, it's going to be on PS2, and one of the reasons I chose doing PS2 is because there's no way to record off of it with the recording device I plan to get in the fall. And I have no money right now to buy it. And a computer, like a laptop that would hook up to it so you're gonna have to suffer through the crappy filming off the TV kind of a uh, deal but don't worry I will be posting and you can still see the video and what's going on pretty well so ignore the graphics because it's PS2 anyway and let's have some fun with some classic PS2 games now this series is uh, NASCAR Thunder 2004 where I will be doing the career mode it was one probably one of my favorite games as a child and uh, it's probably the best NASCAR, no, it's not probably, it is the best NASCAR game ever made. I wish EA still made the games. It's a shame. Now, if you guys want, you can just skip over this part. So, because I'll, I'll just be doing, oh. Oh, Syndicate. Get the PlayStation app. You can message your friends from their PS3s or PS4s. I recommend the app. It's a pretty good app. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I just wish that you centrics would stop making NASCAR because they are ruining it. I mean, this game that you're about to see, 100 times better, more stuff involved, and it's from a better time of NASCAR, too. Now, don't worry, this won't just be NASCAR videos we'll be posting. I mean, I'll do some classic games like Star Wars Battlefront 2, maybe some ATV Off-Road Fury 2, stuff like that. Um, and when I get my recording device, there will be COD, Minecraft, GTA 5, you name it. A lot of the new games too, especially NBA 2K, you're going to be seeing a lot of that. Love those games. Alright, anyway, um, the video is about to start, so I will see you later. Hello everybody, and welcome to NASCAR Thunder 2004, the greatest NASCAR video game ever made. Alright, today I will be doing a Let's Play, and this will be just the first part. Now, as you can see, there are a few game modes. Um, we'll get to those later in another video. And here are some of the game modes, like Season, it's a lot of fun, you should try that out. Thunder License, that's uh, where you, I forget what you do on that one. Lightning Challenge, I believe. No, oh, I forget what that one. Speed Zone, that's where you try to set times, I believe. But we're going to do Career today. Uh, I already have one, but we're going to do a new one today. Alright. Um, how long should we do the race? I don't want to do too long of a season, so it's not a long less to play. Uh, 24 races is long, I'll do 12. Do veteran, rookies, too easy. Race length, what should it be at? I think I'll keep it at 5. That's pretty short. Or, yeah, 5. Um, quick repair, yeah, that's useful. Yellow flag's on, of course. Career tips, sure, why not? Alright, create a car. Ooh, a new car. Oh, that's... Alright, that's a Pontiac. I don't want a Pontiac. Let's see what else there is. Chevy. <laughs> no thanks. Oh, nope, not this one. Oh, boy. Eh, this is cool, but no. 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 Nope. Nope. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ford Taurus. Alright. Alright, let's just add some info here. Alright, there we go. I'm not going to release my real hometown, so I'll just do the generic Chicago. Alright. Because apparently if you're from Illinois, you're from Chicago, according to Wisconsin people. Alright, everything seems to be in check. Alright, edit the car name. Alright. Then, what kind of car? Well, number 83, that works. Let's see what else. Now I'll do full decals.
I believe our car is ready. Looks pretty good. All right. Yes, I want to save these changes. All right. Now I believe it's time to sign sponsors. All right. Now the thing about this one, I'll read this for you. One of the keys to successful NASCAR career is having good sponsors. Don't be enticed by the prospect of big money early on. Make sure that you select a sponsor with the expectations that you can meet. All right. Um, now you want to look at the sponsor expectations. Yeah, I could probably finish 40th place. Easy care. Mm. Now Kmart's way too hard. Yeah, I'll go with easy care, I think. All right. Yes. $8,000. All right. All right. Let's see. Sponsor expectations. I'll do Craftsman because I can qualify 40th about every race. All right. One Craft Kmart Craftsman. Um... I think I can do Kmart. That should be doable. Yes, I'll do Kmart. All right. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. I'll just do the highest paid one because that's really all you have to do. Yep, Craftsman. All right. I think the rest of these are just like if you make the race, you get paid, so... Yep. Alright. I don't know why you wouldn't want to participate in the race. And I don't think you can get kicked. Or first, not qualifying because I don't know why they didn't do that. They should have done that though. That would have made it more realistic. Alright, now I have to pick up my team. You'll need a good team around you to help maximize your success. Your team members are broken down from two groups. The builders and pit crew. Alright. Now, what you want to do is you don't you want to get someone with high potential, not like the best guy right away, because you don't even have the best options right now. So, I think I'm going to go with guys with high potential, because they usually cost less, and they're usually, uh, like, lower skilled, but in the long run, they do have uh, better stats than the guys that you start out with that are a higher price with better capabilities. Um, and if you're wondering how I know all this stuff, I've obviously had this game for close to 10 years, so I've played it quite a bit. It's actually hard to believe it's been 10 years for this game already. Oh, such a great game, though. Yeah, I'll sign him. Alright, let's see. Um, hmm. Who's the better guy? Who's the better guy? Yes. Now, I think a few of these guys I might go with higher skill because I don't want a completely terrible pit crew, but there's honestly not much of a skills difference. Five points max from worst to best in each skill. So, I mean, I'm not really getting much if I go for the highest guy, but still you don't want to go for all the lowest guys too because even though they may cost less, it's still going to impact like your pit road times and yeah. Say you go in like first, you'll come out 20th. You don't want that. Hey, I wonder if that guy's related to Drew Gooden. <laughs> Basketball reference, if you guys didn't get that. <laughs> Alright, now to the catch man. Let's see. Wonder where they come up with these names. Alright, now this is the most important important part. Crew Chiefs. Hey, Trickle, I wonder if he's related to Dick Trickle. No, that is not a penis joke. That's a real NASCAR driver's name. He committed suicide last year. It's kind of sad. He's a great short track racer. Alright, let's see. Yeah, I'll sign him. Chassis Builder. This is important. Now eventually you will get better options than these as you go through your season and as your skills improve. You will get better options to sign. Like It's kind of like free agents and stuff like that. So every season uh, you just sign another person. It's like all one year contracts and stuff like that. So yeah, early on you won't get the best builders and stuff like that. But uh, who cares? Alright. Now uh, I'll be doing a Daytona video next week, and, well, no, not, actually, I'll just, I don't know what I'm going to upload, see you later.